Bang 293. Focus. 193. 150. At 16,000. Is this how that's like 14,000? 14, 14, 1. Oh, I have visual. Tally bandit. Fired right off the nose. Say bonjour. It seemed way too easy. Yeah. So I fired a sidewinder, so we still have all phoenixes. Cool. Well, we're too deep. Uh, what were they now? Uh, 0, 18 for 143 miles. Uh, right there. I would like to see the fucking gun cam of those two girls. Yeah. It's in a five, sir. Where? Uh, you had a main critical at 100 miles, 82 miles, 009. You did have a main critical? I haven't been hearing anything on my RWR. Hold on. Let me turn up my, uh, my volume a bit on it. It said 82 nautical. Oh, it's all the way up. Why was I not hearing anything? I mean, you popped up really fast. I'm gonna do a test real quick. So they might... test. Okay, well I can hear the sound. Twigo one one pre commit. Uh, type F five eighty two miles bearing zero zero. All right. So the issue of um, the fucking whatever this is called. Um, the DDD filter of not scanning anything is now fixed, so I should be able to lock targets now. Yeah. Was it that? That was the problem? That was the problem before. Like, see, right now, what it does is it's it's scanning everything, including the ground. Right. But when we were trying to get those whatever we killed earlier, it was not showing anything. None of the ground, nothing. So no, like, I mean, we got those guys off visual. Uh, we are getting spiked by something. All right, well, I do see the F5 right, now. I see the F5 now. Yep. Let me see if I can scan for him. Uh, do you know his altitude? Is it 13,000? 13,000. 13, right, let me change radar elevation to 13. I'm kind of concerned that the other one's at 17,000 because it's like almost a mile vertical separation. And we will right. be at a disadvantage. I'm changing the scan to 65 for 4 bar. All right. Actually, I had screenshotted something uh, yesterday. The best radar settings for this plane are uh, our RWS of uh, 140 degrees and six uh, six bar. Oh, maybe that does say 140. Oh no, it says 40. I can only do 10, 20, 40, and 65. But that might be actually that might be 140 because that's a lot. Uh, are you seeing a two ship? Uh, yes. Two MiG 28s? Yeah. I'm looking for Alright. Uh, right. So, what is the April? Yeah. Alright, 46 miles. Yeah, uh, see that. Trying to scan for him. See ground. Thirteen. Fuego one one meld F five E forty six point one zero zero nine. We need to start jigging. So I'm gonna head right over thirty three degree offset. So, uh, I, like, the thing I've been reading and learning from actual F-14 pilots on fucking YouTube and shit and on Reddit is uh, you want to be 33 degree offset of their bearings so that you're a beam to them. Okay. 
Alright, so that guy's low at 9,000, so we'll set that to 9. No, not 2. Set that to 9. Let's so put a little bit of distance between us. They're using the mountains. Yeah, because I can see the mountains on my fucking scanning. That's all I see. I can fucking take a radar. Oh god, we're getting way too close. I can't see them at all, and they're directly in front of us, right? Yeah, and they're... Uh, they're... Oh, we're high, though, that's why. We're really fucking high compared to them. Alright, I'll look yeah, low. Yeah, I'm gonna head to Baron 30. Okay, he's gonna be on the left of our radar. Let me check the scan to uh, a little bit tinier. I'm gonna drop this down to 10,000. Scan 4 bar. See if that does anything. Let's stick around. Two. Yeah, I don't see him visually at all. Oh, something's popping up. Hold on. All right, I got something locked. Let me uh identify. Get a rapid identifier on that. I am on. The nose is on it. All right, it's an enemy. Yep. Still got a lock. Sweet. Yep. Fuego one one Fox three bearing three zero two seven point five eighty six ninety eight altitude. All right, a nice thing, keep them locked there because I'm watching the camera. Okay. Up here, I'll uh, be able to confirm Flash. Flash, F5V. E. Oh, good kill, good kill. All right, let's find that other one. Let's break the lock. Here we go, 1-1, one, one, Splash, F5V. E. Uh, that might be... That might be the one we just shot down. I'm not sure. I got one up yep. the left on other you are. Oh, yeah. All right, I'll change over to scan there. Uh, raise the elevation a bit. I don't know what his altitude is. I know I just dropped. Picking up ground clutter, I think. Yeah, he's in the mountains right now. Okay. I'm still just uh, scanning. Three zero five. 35, he's at 7,000. Turn him. 7,000? Trying to flank us. Two ten for 16. Oh, shit. That's... Should be off our nose. Yeah, I'm scanning. I ain't got nothing so far. Two thirty-two. That might be something, or that could be ground. No, that's ground. Now that I actually know how to lock targets, I might have to take a look at. Closer that guide on how to really fine tune we're merged. these guys. Are we? We're merged. Shit. All right, I'll look for him. So I've got nothing on my one eight seven right. nine thousand. He's uh, at our height.
contact. Now is not the time to start drying up on me. Say like one eight seven. Yep. No joy. Merged again. Merged. Man, I have no idea where he is. I can't get a lock on him at all. He's dropping altitude. Focus. One, one. Pop up group. Three, three, one. Four. Four. We have to be merged. Tilt to the uh, to the right. I want to see behind Tilt our wing. Right? Yeah, I just want to see behind our wing. Uh, yeah, I got nothing over here. All right, continue what you're doing. Oh shit! What's that? F five is now behind us at uh, six o'clock on the RWR. I'm bringing us into the vertical. I'm looking for him. I don't see Dick. I'm going to try something. Is uh, I'm going to try firing a missile from back here and see if that works. You can only fire it if you got a lock. Yeah, 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 when I get a lock. Yeah. Oh, I just want to experiment. All right, he's 1.4, but I have no idea where. All right, he's off to our 5 o'clock. Oh, he's behind us now. Yep, yep, yep. I don't think he sees us because he doesn't look like he's merging with us. Is he? Fuck, I lost him. That's the one thing that sucks about this smooth track is you can't really look up very well. That's why I want to buy track IR, but this is a fantastic fucking cheap little upgrade. Um... And I'm blacking out because of the desync, goddamn. Lost him. Yeah. God damn. Focus. Yes, I know we're merged, thank you. All right, it's seven o'clock now. Six o'clock. Uh, I don't see him. State is 8.4. All right, we got one 2.7 and one 3.3, bearing 320 and 346. Low. I don't see him. AWACS, we don't care about that. We care about the ones we're fucking merged with. No, no joy still. 333 for two. That's seven. Oh, what was that? That's something. That could be ground, though. Yeah, that's fucking ground. Come on.
Come on, give me something. I'm more concerned that, like, they're not doing anything. Mm. Like, we haven't been locked a single time. They also haven't really been able to get behind us enough, because they're a fives. They need a Boresight lock. Alright, 139 for 6.6 .6 at 7. Three, two, five, at seven thousand. And we're merged. Okay. Where the fuck is he? Getting visual here. One oh three. Oh, I got him! I got him! Set our oh, ten o'clock. About our height. No joy. Nine o'clock. He's a tiny motherfucker. It's hard to see. Eight o'clock. Alright, he's about your 10 o'clock now. He's low now. You'll see him sticking out. Keep going, keep turning. Fuck, I lost him. There he is. He's almost dead Where? in front of us. Oh shit, now we're... Uh, 11 o'clock, low. There's a black dot in this. He's about to merge with us. He's just about to fly right under us. Dude. See him. Come on, Rudder. Wow, he is fucking slow. Blacked out. Yep, yep. Alright. Uh... Alright, I still have visual. Yeah, I, I do too. Are these like trainee pilots? Like, what the fuck are they doing? Oh, I lost him now. Fuck. I still have visual. You do? Okay. Try to uh, when we turn around and get them. State seven point two. Fuck, I lost him. There he is. Where's he at? He's gonna be dead ahead. Oh yeah, I see him. Merged with two of them. Oh, shit. I think he just kicked on his burners. Unless you hit him with those guns. Alright, I think I got him. He's 7 o'clock now. Low still? Yep. He's saying really fucking low. He's almost blending in with that airport there. He's at the tip of the runway. Nine o'clock. He's fucking landing. Oh, is this an enemy airfield? I don't even know what airport this is. Looks like, uh... It looks like the action... It looks like Tonopah Airport. I think that's where we are. Did he bug out for fuel? Yeah, is that him? Oh, I lost him now. Maybe I was looking at a building. Oh no, I think he crashed. Oh no, but we'd see smoke. Where the fuck did he go? What the fuck? What's going on? 
Are you as confused as I am? Yeah, I really am. <laughs> what is going on? Like we're fucking engaged with ghosts. That guy, like, completely disappeared. I don't know where the fuck he went. What do you want me to alert you of our bingo fuel at? Five or four? I'm just gonna do a little pass and see if we can take out this runway. And... Alright, you check in front, I'll check the one off to our right. Yeah, there's nothing. Fuck. Uh, you can hear the AWACS report, correct? Yeah. Okay. I don't know if that was just maybe me being able to hear it because it's set on my radio. Alright, I don't think he's a... Uh, alive anymore? Is it probably not. Like, I didn't see a crash, but he's now no longer popping up on the picture report. And neither on RWR. Um... Alright, we're heading for Nellis. Okay. Fucking interesting. Wasn't aware that uh, the Soviets created ghost planes. Yeah. It's a uh, newfangled technology. Shit, fucking, that's scarier than the SG 27. The funniest that wasn't thing. SG 27? <laughs> or, I'm sorry, SG 57. Funniest thing I have ever heard from somebody. I showed one of my buddies a video of the a flight of four fifty mm. sevens fly over Russia, and you know the fucking terrifying trumpet sound of it flying over, right? Like that signature sound it has. Yeah, yeah. So I showed him that video. He's like, "What was that?" And I'm like, "That is the Russians' uh, new stealth jet." He's like, "That doesn't sound very stealthy to me." I'm like. Face palm. I'm like, that's that. <laughs> like, no, stealth technology, not like you can't hear it. He's like, oh. But he was like, I was just like, oh, that was fucking fantastic. Okay. Well, now we have one bearing 54, 79, heading 248. So they're heading almost right. We're probably going to merge with them. Yeah. Popped up. FF. Yeah, so you, we're at, we're definitely at Tonopa. So shortly we should probably be seeing Tonopa range. If we're going the direction, I think. Are you sure going. that was Tonopa? That was definitely Tonopa because that signature fucking curvy airstrip that we flew over is one of the only ones that I think it looks like that. Take a quick glance at them. Yeah, because it's definitely not Creech, because that's a friendly. It's definitely not Feedy. What's that? Still the fucking FF. Yeah, no, it, it, had, to yeah, it had to have been Tonopa. So yeah, we should probably see uh, the test range. So that's why we didn't land. We didn't get fuel earlier. We landed at the test range. Yeah. So we should just turn back to Tonopa and get fuel. Well, I think that might be red. That's why he was landing there. Because you can't tell if they're blue or not in hardcore, which kind of sucks. Oh, shit. I see 19 minutes. Oh, that's, uh, that might be... That has to be Groom Lake blocking us. Groom Lake, you think? I mean... What else would it be? Uh, well, there is an infantry assault mission... Just to the uh, east of Tonopah, a little south. 
I know, but I don't think infantry would be launching fridge-sized missiles. <laughs> you, you ever see those SA-19s before they hit you? You look over and there's a fucking fridge right next to you. <laughs> <laughs> it just... <laughs> okay. Fucking, it's like the Scottish eating fucking telephone poles. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna fucking merge with these guys quick. They're fucking high. Stop doing your thing. Yep, I'm scanning. We ain't gonna be able to be on the station long. Fucking 19. Fuego 11, pre commit, bearing 062, altitude 29880. You got him visually? I got him. I'm watching him on the track. It's a SU 17 splash. Nice. Alright, cool. Uh, state is 4.2. Let's bug out of here. Alright. Want me to Joe and drop tanks? Uh, yeah. No, 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 no. No? Okay. Still got like a thousand pounds of fuel in one. <laughs> Oh, really? Okay. I'm still used to the fucking uh, F-18 using all the fuel and just jettisoning them as they're like, nope, see ya at 10,000. Alright, Rio's gotta go take a pee in his diaper. I'll be right back. Oh, oh there's the headbutt of the fucking... Alright. I, I will run! Oh, uh, Matthew? Andrew, pinch it off. We're about to merge. Okay. <laughs> My phone is left down here. <laughs> as soon as you left, it was like zero, zero, one seventy for 71. I was like, oh no, Andrew. <laughs> All right, well. 57 miles, 166. Good thing is, I just put eye drops in so my contacts feel fantastic. <laughs> So you won't have your Rio go blind on you, because I'm telling you, if I go fucking blind, we are definitely screwed. The fucking fear. Pinch it off, we're about to be merged. <laughs> Maybe I'll just start wearing a fucking diaper while playing this game. Way going 1-1, one, one, recommit bearing 166. I think behind us now. Zero, zero, 007. It's off to our fucking left. Zero zero three for one point seven at twenty thousand. Oh, that's why these are all low level threats. Oh fuck! Missile! 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 Oh god, we're shaking too much. I can't flare. Jesus Christ! Must have been a fox too. It definitely was. Glad you saw it. I, like, looked over and I was like, that's a weird-looking cloud. <laughs> <laughs> that's a weird-looking cloud? Oh, shit! Why does that cloud have a trail and it's coming towards us? Alright, I don't know where he went. Matt, we are at state 2.7. We need to get the fuck out of here. We're bugging out. We're gonna have to... Just hope to God that he is a horrible shot. Yeah, we lost him. Looks Good. like... Put 13 miles between us. God. These guys are like, nah, man, fucking Patty and Rooster are getting good at flying. They ain't easy targets anymore. <laughs> That's a weird looking cloud. <laughs> I might have to quote you on that. <laughs> That's a weird looking cloud. Oh shit, missile, missile! They have the same mountains they use to mask themselves. We're using the mask off, so. Them some beautiful looking low quality mountains. They some beautiful looking low quality mountains, yes sir. That's why I need a 2000 or 3000 series. Up those graphics here. Uh, he might be chasing back after us again. Eh, kinda. He's heading 245, so he's heading our direction. 12.8. I mean, we have to actually head his direction. The airport's that way. Okay.
Fucking Christ. Well, how many kills is that? Did we get three, we two? Have four right now. Four? Cool. Okay, you know what? I'll pull up the Through the Inferno page. Let's see what we got. Andrew, I'm having navigation issues. My tack end's not working properly. We need to start VFRing. VFR? Yeah, Visual we need to figure out where rules? we are. Yeah, we need to figure out where we are by landmarks. Okay. We got 34 minutes till. Uh, uh, no, we actually have eight air-to-air -air kills. Oh. Yeah, but this flight, this flight so oh, far. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Um. All right, so I see a fucking four thingy of something. Possibly be. What direction are we heading right now? Oh, I got us going the right way. Mountain. Some fucking. You know, we you know where we're going right now, or do you still need some? Uh... I, I got us going. There we're gaining range closer oh. to. Okay. Uh... The problem is, uh, state is one point seven, and he is now seven point five. Uh, up behind us. Oh no! Actually, off to our front. Uh, left or right a little bit somewhere. You walk him. Um. I can search for him. Yeah, do that. Now he's 11. Okay, he's bugging out. Alright, we're fine. You know roughly how far we are. It doesn't look good, Andrew. It's 146 miles with uh, fucking 1,500 pounds. Could happen. For some reason, I have Willy Wonka stuck in my head. Willy Wonka. Willy Wonka. I think I might know where we are. Don't quote me on that. Because I think I'm wrong. There's another guy on 254. Cool. That would be uh, Speeder 11 Ocho Muerte in an F 14. <laughs> Means eight death. What's that? That means eight deaths in uh, Spanish. Oh. Damn, this this server's getting populated. I just I'm launched gonna... something, and I'm not sure what it is. Can you IFF that real fast? Before I fox it? DDD interrogate fast? friendly or foe. I'm doing that. I don't know what that does. I don't know how to tell if that's a friend or not. Can you look it up? Sure. Because I'm going to delete that target. Oh, I see him. Do you? I see it on the camera. Can you see what it is? Uh... <laughs> Back on, man. Andrew, drop the lock. You locked the tanker. Oh. <laughs> drop the lock. Okay. It's locked. It's dropped. We're good. <laughs> that wouldn't have been good. I looked, I looked at my TV screen. I'm like, that looks like a Russian-looking plane. <laughs> my dumb mouth would have fired. Jesus Christ. All right. State is uh, 13. 
We have a 23 on RWR. Someone can get me out of scared. Well, Lake uh, Oriole 1 1 DC'd. The one time I could actually get a lock on something that seems decently far away, and it's the fucking tanker. You know what that is? I wonder if it's because you there might be like a radar setting that has it so that it only will lock up larger aircraft unless you have it on like a certain setting. You know, like with the um, with the AIM-120, so you have to select the size of your target. Yeah, which I never do. <laughs> good thing is I have us at the recommended max efficiency settings. Well, that's good. have an hour of flight left. I'm sorry. Uh, it's an hour, so 2,000 pounds is an hour, so we have about 35-ish minutes, count it. Yeah. I have no idea where the fuck we are. We're over a really large mountain. In the desert. This would be the desert. Um, jettison everything except stations three and six. Is that a good jettison? Yep. Cool. Hopefully that'll give us, uh, a little bit more range here. State 11. Or 1.1, I should say, not 11. I wish we were at 11. Wish we were at 11. We need to, like, try to sort of figure out where the fuck we are. Hey, I'm, I'm doing my best here, boss but all it is is just flat fucking desert and a couple mountains. I know. None of that's really descriptive. What did you set our tack hand to exactly? Do you know what that waypoint is? So I set to 12, but Room Lake is the closest airfield. Really? Yeah. Well, that's concerning because Groom Lake is still very fucking far away from, uh, Nellis. Uzi, one, one. Request navigation assistance. Oh, yes, good choice. You might have to go to uh, 266 on your radio to have that work. I think it's got to be the... Yeah, I think I'll set mine to 254. Because I know with my AWACS on uh, the one, one. Request navigation on the F-18, it has to be radio 1. Let me see if I can try. Uh, how did you get that to... Um... Actually, uh, how are you selecting that free, um, the request navigation assistance? Uh, the backslash menu. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Which uh, flight, wingman, ATC? ATC, and then uh, I'm going to Tampanoa. Test range? Yeah. Oh, I meant the navigation assistance one. Alright, you know what? What's the tacking for Tampanoa? Um, 
77. 87? 77. State is one. You want me to jettison these two phoenixes too? Yeah. He's saying on 254. He's inbound. Inbound for what? Us? No, no, no. Inbound for Nellis. It's not grabbing the tank. You know, here. I'm trying to visually find where the fuck we are. Because that thingy down there, that little canyon type thing at about 10 o'clock, is like our, my best fucking guess at trying to figure out where the hell we are. Would that be the city of Alamo? That might be the city of Alamo off to our about 10 o'clock. 10 o'clock? Yeah, it's just east of Groom Lake. You see that, like, red area down there? So is there a lake nearby? Small one? I don't fucking know. State is is uh not good this has got to be that fucking highway though right what if we just start heading bearing um about one five one five or hundred and fifty uh 150, my bad. Something was just popping up on my uh, radar screen. I think I might know where the fuck we are, but it's a best guess for our fucking state point eight. Are we gonna have to just put this bitch down in the desert? Uzi, one, one, inbound. Assistance. Look up the TAC in for Room Lake. Room Lake looks like it's channel 1 8. Area 51, we're fucking coming for you. I think that might be a red. Um, airfield, though. <laughs> 
range point uh, two point oh. Oh shit! Is that Groom Lake? Oh no, I don't know what that is. Um, we are so fucking fucked. <laughs> Are we just gonna have to like set her down in the fucking that uh flat area desert off to our left, right? I mean I'd prefer not to. I mean we've got seven hundred pounds, Matt. Yeah, and the engine's cut at three hundred, so we have four hundred pounds. <laughs> Just a bit. Andrew, I see water in front of us. Water? Yeah. Like there's a bunch of little lakes. Bunch of little lakes. Uh, in like a row? Yes. I can't see it, so unfortunately, I won't be able to look at the map for what I'm looking for. Bunch of little lakes. Oh. We might be near Echo Bay. You think so? Maybe. State point six. <laughs> Are we about to tell the taxpayers we just lost them a lot of money? We're saving this bitch for the taxpayers. You putting her down? Yeah, I try to. Okay. I don't know where the fuck we are. Oh yeah, I see those little lakes you're talking about. Best bet would be we're near Alamo. Or we're too far away from any airstrip at that point. Mid 100 miles, hold eye, 270. Imagine just driving along the desert and seeing an F 14 coming in to land. <laughs> we could find a nice strip of highway, like flat highway to land on. That'd be fantastic. Fortunately, we only have 200 pounds of fuel already. Put her down in the Mojave. <laughs> Put her down in the Mojave. <laughs> that needs to be on the front of both our planes. <laughs> Brace for impact. All right, I I put her down in the Mojave. What? <laughs> See if I can get us onto the road. This thing does not like being off-road, as I found out the other night. No. no. Well, there you go. You know what, let's just fucking drive her home like this. We might have better fuel efficiency than flying, to be honest. Like, fucking just get on the road, and then very, very slightly put the throttle on. Yeah, she- oh, now we're down to 300. Yeah, the engine's just flamed out. Well, yep, there goes the electronics. All right, let's get the AC rolling. There we go. <laughs> All right. All right. <laughs> now, I want to some. I wish there was just an option to get out of this thing so I could stand by the fucking road and just hitchhike. There we go. Oh, um, I ejected with the plane on my screen. <laughs> oh, there we go. Oh, uh, Matt, I think I died. Oh, no. I'm still conscious. Are you conscious? Uh, well, 
I'm in a third person, like really far away screen of, uh, yeah, I think. Why is my screen doing this? Can I move forward? Three one one, two times four, eight point three. We see you. 